Ah, you'll have to come back later. This is my break. I simply want a few words with the mayor. Not possible. The mayor is not here at this time. I don't want to bother you. But the mayor suggested I enjoy the view of Ilsmouth from his... Ah, yes. You must be the photographer. It's about the next edition of the Ilsmouth Town Hall Journal, I suppose. No, I'm the reporter. Well, all right. But don't go touching anything. Can't leave anyone alone. I met Mr. Underhouse. He claims there's a diary locked inside the mayor's safe. He could not give me the combination, but suggested I reread the Bible and find the figures that symbolize evil. Page 303. St. Paul's Epistles, chapter 3, verse 16. Destruction and despair will cross their path. Page 181, Acts of the Apostles, chapter 1, verse 15. And Peter stood up among the assembled brethren, some five score and twenty, Page 345, The Apocalypse According to St. John, Chapter 13, Verse 8, And the number of the beast is 666. The Mayor's Office. Let's see. A few papers. Nothing very important just a desk lamp. There's a handle hidden in this painting. Let's see. It's exactly as I thought.
Why don't I unscrew this case? What's this inside? A piece of paper. A parcel to collect at the post office. Hmm, it's addressed to W. Hambleton. My name's Jonas. Jonas Hambleton. In 1829, I made my fortune, the hard way, at sea. Even the big Boston businessmen were jealous of my fishery. At that time, I became interested in the occult. I read only the most accursed books. And then, I met Narakamus. He initiated me into the ancient practices. At last, I was in contact with those from the outside. Each day my knowledge grew deeper, my body regenerated, my hands were at last palmed. But the ancients wanted more, much more. I gave in. My own wife, Lavina, was the bargain, you see. I screamed out the invocations, and he came. The sea would take all I cherished, but that was of no importance. The pitiless god Dagon wanted that union. That was the price of my immortality. Two sons were born of that wondrous night, Wilbur and Curtis. The second of them betrayed and abandoned me, but the first followed in my footsteps. He has my gift. He can beg to the stones. They all think I'm dead. Only he who reaches that place where water, earth and sky come together can find my burial place. Our work was destroyed in 1834, all because of that accursed Boliskin. But gods are immortal. And time means nothing to me. Nobody can destroy the families without the statuettes which I guard and the secret incantation. In 1910, the comet will come again and the prophecy will come true. The great ancients will reign. I will swim beside my Lavina in the abyss, and we shall sing the praises of he who cannot be named. I'll put the diary back in its place. I have found the diary Mr. Underhouse told me about. All began with Jonas Hambleton, father to Wilbur and Curtis. Then, in 1834, four Ilsmouth families made a pact with Narakamus, who promised them immortality in exchange for their help in bringing the great old ones back to defeat these four families and prevent the return of Cthulhu. I must find four statuettes in J. Hambleton's crypt. Then I must await the passage of the comet. Nobody really knows if old Jonas is really dead.
Miss Picard talked about a young man. I suppose she hopes to have her niece married before winter. I pity the poor fellow, whoever he is. Some books and a few files of no interest. It seems that the mayor works about as hard as his staff. Excuse me, but I for one have work to do. So, you're on an errand for Mr. Hamilton. That'll be three dollars, please. That must be a frock. Mr. Hamilton always orders them from Boston. Thank you. Good day. Let's see what's in this package. You wanted to see me, Mr. Bishop? A word of advice. Be careful. Of what? And of whom? You see, I happen to live next door to the Hamiltons, and there's some strange goings on there. Is that so? Yes, Illsmith has been cursed. I think you're here to help us. I just wanted you to know that you can count on me. That's a heartwarming offer. I'll need all the help I can get.